Botswana's former leader Ian Kama says the people of Zimbabwe have shown tremendous resilience in the face of a brutal regime. He says the neighboring country is in crisis. Kama took part in a meeting to discuss the situation in the southern African nation. The webinar also tried to chart a way forward. Recently, an ANC delegation met with the country's ruling ZANU-PF in an attempt to find a permanent solution in Zimbabwe. Abductions, incarcerations of journalists, politicians from other parties, lawyers and many other people, and still many Zimbabweans moving outside the country as a result of all this, clearly indicate that today, 40 years since independence, the only thing that has changed is the name of the country and that of its leaders. In plain English, there is a crisis in Zimbabwe, not just challenges. With extreme difficulty, all man-made and growing in intensity and long-lasting. That's why that ZANU-PF official used the word crisis almost 14 times at one stage, more than any other word in that briefing. A leader has one responsibility and one only, and that is to mobilize and motivate programs and policies in the best interests of citizens and not in their self-interest. People's lives matters. Zimbabweans' lives matter.